Thanks more from Travis at 5 o'clock. Tomorrow, a historic day in Charleston for the first time in 40 years. The Holy City will officially have a new mayor. Friday was Mayor Joe Riley's last day as chief executive. At the end of the workday, he said farewell to city employees, and he left the city hall for the last time as mayor. Now, tomorrow, Charleston's new mayor, John Tecklenburg, will be sworn in at noon. Mayor-elect Tecklenburg will take the oath of office, serving as Charleston's first new mayor in four decades. Just last week, News 2's Brad Franco sat down with the mayor-elect as he prepares to make history. Has it, has it set in yet, or do you know when it will if it hasn't? Well, I, I'm ready to serve. You know, uh, we have the swearing in on Monday and uh, Tuesday is my first city council meeting and there's already a full agenda for that so I'm going to be hitting the ground running and um, so in a way it has it has hit and I'm, I'm, I'm ready. I'm, um, you can see more of Brad's conversation with Mayor-elect Tecklenburg on our website countonto.com. Now you can watch Mr. Tecklenburg be sworn in as Charleston's new mayor. We will be there live tomorrow. The entire swearing in ceremony goes from noon until 2 with a pre-program celebration which begins at 11 in the morning. Several downtown roads will be closed for these events. Broad Street will close between church and meeting at 8.30 tomorrow morning. Broad Street from Church to King and Meeting Street from Queen to Trad will close at 11. Now those sections will reopen no later than 3 tomorrow afternoon.